Hi everyone, how are you today? <clears throat> well, spring is here, and one of the best things about spring is that the flowers start growing again. And tulips are one of the first plants to come out of the ground. So today I've got two simple crafts you can do at home with tulips. So, first of all, let's take a sheet of paper. Heavy paper is good. I'm going to do this one first. I'm just going to paint some stems for my tulips. You can paint as many as you want. If you want to paint some leaves on them, you can. Because tulips are a sign of spring. And then, to make my tulips, <clears throat> I took a plastic fork and I just put it in the paint. And you might need to experiment with this a bit. Oh, that one's pretty bloggy. But we can make it look like a tulip. And you can make as many tulips as you want. With forks. Let's make a purple tulip over here. Get some purple on there. Oh, we have some pink here. Make a pink tulip. So that's an easy way to make tulips <clears throat> with forks. But if you want to really get messy, how about some hand painting? So your hands are smaller than mine. You'll get a lot more than I will. But we can make a stem. And then we can paint our hands. You can just stick your hand right in the paint, or you could paint it on with a paintbrush. Need lots of paint to make it look like a hand. So you might just want to stick your hand right in the paint and squish it around. I'm just doing it like this. And then, or you could use your feet if you want to, but this might look more like a tulip. And then take your hand and press it on your paper and you have a hand print tulip. So those are just two easy ways to make some tulips at home. And you can get this paint at the dollar store or maybe even use some pudding or something at home that mom has. And you can make some flowers for spring because spring is here. Hope you have a good day and we'll see you soon. Goodbye.